Hey guys, sorry I took a break. I was really not feeling well. Actually, I could barely get out of bed for a few days. I am thankfully on the mend. I'm feeling better. I have more energy. I still have a little bit of a cough and congestion. I think you can hear it a little bit in my voice. Um, unfortunately, my sleep schedule has been all the way flipped around and I'm wanting to sleep it during the day and not at night. So that's been fantastic because <laughs> I have so much to get done. I have none of my Christmas gifts wrapped. I do not have my ornaments on my tree. I have not baked anything. Tomorrow, my youngest daughter has a choir concert that I'm going to. I'm probably not going to film there. I don't really feel comfortable filming other people's kids, teenagers, whatever. I might try and get a little bit of footage uh, before and after if my child feels comfortable with that, but you know how teenagers are, so we'll see how that goes. Um, and then Thursday, we are going to my fiance's to spend Christmas and spend a few days as a family over there. And we're gonna cook a big English style roast dinner because that's what everyone agreed on. And I'm gonna make some special desserts. Um, I've been kind of in my head a little bit lately because it's the holiday season and my grandparents aren't here and my mother-in-law passed away. So that's been kind of paired with not feeling good that's kind of been on my mind. So. That's another reason I haven't really filmed very much. I just feel kind of like the Grinch this year. <laughs> I don't know how else to explain it. We have a small family anyway. I mean, I have a lot of relatives in Wisconsin that I, they're my family. But I live like 14 hours away, so I don't really get to see everyone for the holidays. So it's just my mom, her husband, um my fiance, his dad, and our kids. Because I don't have a relationship with my sister, it's it's all bad. We don't talk at all. So, yeah. Small family problems. But I'm much happier not talking to her. And I know it's best for me and my kids, so it's going to stay like that. Because it just has to. I can't be around toxic people. Um... All right, anyway, back on to better news. I am going to take you guys along with me as I get some stuff done around the house today. You know, all the stuff I've been neglecting while I've been sick. Um, I will probably film a true crime video later after I get some makeup and stuff on because, hello, I look crazy right now. This is in all my <laughs> sickly glory looking like this. Um, but yeah, that's what's been going on with me. How have you guys been I'm trying to decide if I want to make chili mac, which is super easy, or if I want to put a roast in the crock pot for dinner. I might just do the chili mac because it's cold and crappy today, so that sounds kind of good and easy. But I will see you guys in a bit as I'm getting things done. Hey guys, I am making dinner. I decided on chili mac because I didn't want to wait on the slow cooker. And this is just boiled noodles, add chili, add cheese, dinner done. So that's what I went with. I have laundry going. I'm going to eat after this is done. And then I am probably going to uh, record a true crime video maybe. And then I have cookies to bake. I might make some homemade ornaments. Um, Probably gonna have a glass of wine, because damn it, I deserve it. And that's what's going on right now. So hopefully in a little bit I won't look like this anymore. But that's what's going on with me right now. Okay, so change of plans. I'm not baking tonight. I am gonna do that. Tomorrow, probably after my daughter's concert, when I have a little bit more time because I don't want to stay up super late because my sleep schedule is all messed up, yada yada yada, you know. So, did some makeup, 
looking a little more alive now. Otter is behind me because he thinks I'm talking to him. Hi, Otter. So I'm going to be doing a true crime video and then might have a glass of wine. I don't really want to drink while I'm doing the video because I have the lovely side effect of when I drink, I turn completely red. <laughs> Gotta love those Native American jeans that I have. Like, it's bad when people are drinking with me that I've never been around before. They're like, oh my god, are you okay? What is wrong with you? Like, Patricia, I'm fine. I just turn red when I drink. It's okay. <laughs> But I will see you guys in a little bit. I'm going to be doing a relatively new case. Usually I cover older ones. But this one reminded me of a case that my family is linked to. My great-grandfather was the police officer. He worked on the case. I'll explain it in the true crime video. But there are some similarities between the two cases. But I'll see you guys in a bit. Got my true crime video all done. I am editing and uploading that now. I'm going to get a couple more things done around the house. I'm going to take a snack break and have this delicious sounding spiced apple salad because, you know, it sounds delicious. And then I'm probably going to lay down because I don't want to be like half asleep or drowsy at my daughter's concert tomorrow because that would be rude. <sighs> So that is what I'm going to do for the rest of the night. But I'm probably also going to be baking and stuff tomorrow too. So when I get home, we can do that together. Since I've missed the past few days of uploading because I've been sick. But I think I'm going to end it here, guys. I'm going to have my salad. I'm going to get some cleaning done. And then probably go to bed. Well wash my face because I don't want to wake up looking like, you know, a member of KISS in the morning. My cat just tried to knock over my camera, so I will see you all later. <laughs>